Welcome back. We're now joined by Tina Brolin from the High Plains Food Bank and Matt Edwards from United. How are y'all doing this morning? Doing great, Sheldon. Very How good. are you? Thank you. Thanks doing for having us. Good. Of course, yeah, glad to have y'all on. So, of course, you know, it's the season of giving. Of course, High Plains Food Bank always, you know, we want to keep you guys at the forefront of everything, the good work that y'all do. But we're coming up on next Monday. It's got the High, Pl High Plates Food Bank, if I could say it right, the Together We Can Food Drive, a really big time for United, the food bank, everything like that. Of course, you know, here at New Shelton, we like to partner with y'all. So, I mean, yes. are, are you all ready for it? We are ready. We look forward to this event every year. We love gathering with the community. There are so many businesses, organizations, and individuals that come out and support the food bank celebrate the holidays and help out our neighbors who are facing food insecurity and we think that's a great mission for sure so for maybe some of our viewers who aren't terribly familiar with the together we can food drive can you give us kind of the rundown of what people can expect with this next week well we'll be at market street matt's more familiar with the event than i am because i've only been a part of the event for five years matt tell them about it well i believe we've been hosting the the event since uh 2000 so okay. this is this will be our 23rd year of uh, of hosting uh, uh, the Together We Can Food Drive. Uh, it's going to be a big time for sure. So tell us you know, more about from your perspective being with United, getting to work with organizations like the Food Bank and really to help, like I said, fixing you know, and helping food fight food insecurity in our area. You know, it's just a natural partnership. It's, uh, we're, we're a supermarket. We sell food. The Food Bank needs food. And, uh, and, and United Supermarkets has always been known for their generosity and as well as giving back to the community. So uh, it just becomes a natural partnership for us. Right. So what do folks need to know as we're gearing up for the food drive? You know, there's lots of ways to donate. So what Absolutely. do folks need to know kind of preparing for the food drive, of course, starting on Monday? Well, if you'd like to come out and see us, we'll be at Market Street yeah. Monday through Friday of next week from about 10 a.m. through the 10 p.m. newscast with yes. News Channel 10. That's and right. you can bring your donations of food or funds, and we'll gladly accept those. You can run in, and when you're grabbing your items at any United supermarket, um, have your cashier do a scan tag donation for you, and that comes directly to High Plains Food Bank and is spread across the 29 counties that we serve and 140 agency partners that are serving over 10,000 families and 20,000 individuals each month. Or if you can't make it out to see us or make it out to the store, um, you can always give online at hpfb.org. I mean, that's the great thing is that there's so many different opportunities for sure. And I mean, the scan tags, I mean, you've talked about, you know, maybe some people think like, oh, I gave just a few dollars. That's not really going to go that far. I mean, tell us about, I mean, how far one dollar can go in helping out the food bank. Well, one dollar goes really far. Your dollar matters because we can provide 13 meals with every dollar that's donated. And we put 94 cents of your dollar directly toward our mission of feeding our neighbors. I'd say I think that's great for sure. I mean, like I said, just tell us more about your perspective. I mean, just getting to help out with that because, like you said, you know, United, of course, being tied in with it 23 years now is fantastic. I mean, what's yeah. some of your favorite parts about it? You know, it, it's it's seven. We have 17 locations in the in, from Perryton to Plainview, and so that it's super easy to make a donation. Um, uh, as Tina said, for a dollar you can provide 13 meals. Uh, we, we've set a goal this year of $60,000. We're going to raise $60,000. Uh, we are about halfway there, and uh, we haven't even started the food drive yet. So, <laughs> and that's a good start. <laughs> and so we're, we're, uh, and then United Supermarkets is going to pitch in ten thousand dollars at the end. So, so I think yeah. all, all in all, uh, we should see at least seventy thousand dollars raised. But we still need people to go out and, and go to their United, whether it's in Perryton, Plainview, uh, Amarillo, uh, Market Street, Amigos, United, mm -hmm. uh, any of those stores, and make a donation. All right. Awesome. Well, thank you all for coming and talking to us this morning. Well, thank you for course. having us. Of course, yeah, and that's right. To Together We Can Food Drive starts on Monday. News Channel 10, we're going to be out there. It's going to be a fun time for sure, so make sure to tune in for that and go and donate to the High Plains Food Bank. So coming up here in a little bit, we're going to be talking to Stephanie Tucker.